to the next question here from Gabriel Hernandez. What if this deal falls through? If the Las Vegas proposal falls through for whatever reason, do the A's resort back to Oakland and start where they left off, or do they have to restart the process? A couple things you need to know about this. The A's have an exclusive negotiating agreement with the Port of Oakland that is now coming up on four years old. It was signed in May of 2019. It expires in just a couple weeks in May of 2023. Without that, the A's don't necessarily have the ability to make an agreement on a deal. It's kind of the foundation of everything. Now, they've been in good relationships with the port, so there should not be a problem to renew this. But I think to answer the question more, more plainly, yes, they do have the opportunity to go back to Oakland. Mayor Shang Tao said in her press conference yesterday that she will be ready to take that phone call if the A's are wanting to come back to it. And mind you, reports say that the A's and the city of Oakland were supposed to have a three-day summit this week to have an ultimatum on a decision. And we've seen all of this before in Northern California. At one point, the San Francisco Giants were out the door to Tampa. The Sacramento Kings in the last decade were on their way first to Anaheim and then Seattle. And then following what seemed to be a major development like what we witnessed about 48 hours ago, things turned for the better for both Northern California teams in terms of staying here. So. Again, not to lead anybody on, but to give you perspective on the bigger picture, sometimes twists and turns happen before you ultimately get what you want. Okay, let's move on.